Hello, this is Paul here. How may I help you? Well, your colleague has said that you treat babies, and I was wondering yeah. if um, if you could help with with the problems that, that my little boy's got. Um, right. He's just been very unsettled for quite a few weeks now, particularly yeah. in the evenings. Yeah. The kind of squirming about, arching his back, crying. Yeah. Have you taken him to um, a GP or something like this? Well, I've, I have spoken to the health visitors and, and they say things like, well, babies, babies do cry and it'll grow out of it. And I feel like they're not really, not really listening. What we would do is find out generally, I mean, what, what kind of a birthing process it was, I don't really... Well, it, it, was, it had quite a long labour, but, um, mm. but then in the end um, had to have a section. Right. You see, quite often... This is the issue with the way the the baby. How old is the baby now? It's um eight weeks. Eight well, weeks. eight and a half weeks thereabouts. Yeah. And a lot of it would stem from um, the birthing procedure itself. A lot of problems that can occur now because of um modern medicine that they don't want to do it the natural way, um and they they are told they they. They want to make sure that um, they're bringing the baby out and they're making sure that you're, you're safe as well. And um, that actually has, from a chiropractic perspective, a few issues attached to it because of how, how they're actually bringing the baby out of you. And that usually stems um, from the beginning of what the problem is. And the chiropractor there would have a little look through that, go through the history, go through the different lots of different things from there. And then, then give some diagnosis from there on in. I mean, there's not much. I can't turn back the clock, you know, with, with what happened no. with the birth, no. it, what's happened, what's happened, you know. Just to put you in the picture of after the treatment, because it's such a young baby now, the chiropractor here has been dealing with babies for as young as one week when we've had them, as soon as they've um, come out of hospital, the patients have brought them in and we've had them check and they've got them all right. and. All our patients, when they're, they're pregnant, they come through, they all bring the baby in to get have a quick look and quick get checked over. And um, there's always something that we, we actually help them with. So you do see them from, from a very young age. It would eight weeks be unusually young? No, I would say it's probably about seven weeks too late. Some of the patients that we've had from that have had babies have brought them in in and day seven, day ten, some this kind of, but more or less as soon as they've been released. When we had um, we we had a couple of midwives in that were seeing us a couple of years ago, and we had a stream of babies. After we found that after the midwives understood what we're about and understood the whole procedure of how we did it and why we did it, we got loads and loads of babies that were coming in. But you've got to be pretty open to it. Some people are not the chiropractor here herself has never had any um, medication. As an example, her children haven't had any medication, never had any um, injections or anything like that, and they're all okay. It depends upon the the. Oh, so they're not had the um, had the jabs. No, because my not had it's just coming up for the first for the first yeah. lot of jabs actually, and I mean that's another thing I'm worried about to be honest. There's a lot of um, there's a lot of scaremongering goes on with regards to what you should be having and. Yeah, I mean, you just hear different things from different people all the time, yeah, you know. this is it. There's no reason for it to go. The babies that are coming in, everything gets looked after. We are yeah. primary care, which means there's lots and lots of different rules and regulations in accordance with uh, the governmental legislation that we have to follow. It's not like you go into some back street kind of a um, quackery here. It's a, this is primary care that we're dealing with, and um, so can we just can we just call in? No, uh, um, we're, we're seeing approximately um, eighty to a hundred um, hundred patients a day here. Um, very very busy. Well, that you'd have to book in, right. and reserve a time, take it from there.